Hi guys. Okay, so this video is going to be a bit different than um, the usual videos. I got contacted by Olight. They are a manufacturer of different types of, of lights. Um, they have torches, they have gun mounted lights, they have long range shooting lights and a whole lot of stuff uh, in between. And um, they have a Black Friday special that starts when this video is released. And with that special, you get uh, the Olight, uh, the, Val the PL Mini Valkyrie 2. Um, that is a Picatinny mounted um, uh, flashlight. And with that, uh, for free, you get this little I1R2 um, flashlight. So let's see what is in the box. Before I open, uh, to be honest, I did open it up and just tested it and see that everything works. And if I wanted to do a review, because I don't want to review anything that, um, that you would not, that, that I would not recommend or use personally. And I have to say, um, well, because I'm doing this review, it's, it's quite a nice light. So, um, let's open it up. It comes, um, with this very cute, uh, pull tab that you can just pull out and with that you get the light and a bunch of extra stuffies and on the box it says it is uh, 600 uh, lumens max and 100 meter throw and uh, the name that's basically what is on the box let's put that aside okay so you get the charger it looks very interesting, very funny, but there is a reason for that that we will get to in a moment. You get the, the manual and then you get a spare part, which I believe is uh, for down here, if you maybe have a, a thicker Kittini mount. And then you get a Allen key that you can remove the, um, the mount part with. And there is a letter that says, thank you for being a part of our Olight family. You, your support is why we do this. Enjoy the Olight team. So that is very nice. And we'll set that aside. In the manual, it states it's 600 to 60 lumens, uh, 60 minutes runtime, 100 meter beam, 60, uh, IPX6 rated, so that is, um, I believe, uh, um, splash and that type of thing. It's one meter drop, uh, resistant, and uh, 73 grams. And then they just show how to charge it. They say it's fully charged in less than an hour. And that is basically what they, they say. So let's put uh, the booklet aside. And we look at the, uh, let's maybe take the light first. Okay, so this is the PL Valkyrie Mini 2. It is a, a um, pistol mounted light. It uh, mounts with a Picatinny rail. You open it up and you can press it to open it up a bit wider. And when it's open, you can also move it back and forth and also take it off the mount. And then you close it to fasten it. Um, it has the very, very small LED um, up front. And um, there is uh, how you activate it is you press the button here um, at the back. You press it once, it's, uh, it goes on. You press it again, it switches off on off and the same with the left side on off on off if you hold it in and you release it then it's basically um just like a a touch switch um and then at the bottom that is where it gets pretty cool this is its charging port that is why you have this interesting looking charger if i bring them close you'll see the the Charger wants to connect to the port because it's magnetic. So that is really, really cool. Okay, this is a normal USB charger. 
You can charge it with a battery pack. You can charge it with a normal uh, wall socket. You can put it in your laptop. You can put it in a car USB charger. You can basically charge it anyway. Um, you just uh, put the, the USB in the USB. It will have a green light when it's fully charged or when there's no current running like now. Then when you fit it to the light, it will um, turn red and start charging. This one is not turning red because I already charged it up because after this, I'm going to do a test to see if um, how long it lasts. And for that, I want a full battery. And then there is this little I1R2 um, mini flashlight. It's the same as the same packaging. Um, you have a little pull tab, you pull it out, and there you have your little your little flashlight. This one is blue, you can get a random color um, when you get the uh, PL Mini 2 um, for the Black Friday special. Uh, you get the booklet. It says on high power it's 150 lumens for 15 minutes and on low power it's 5 lumens for uh, 6 hours. And it is, um, it is said that uh, the running time is the time when the brightness um, attenuates to the 50% of uh, the initial value of the battery is fully charged. So if uh, you get half the brightness, then the battery is considered um, uh, discharged and you need to charge it again um, but we will we will test that then you get a little um, charger USB to micro USB this is what the light charges with um, both of these lights have internal batteries that you can recharge that is pretty nice so you don't have to um, get new little batteries and yeah that can be a real pain so let's put this aside also and this is the little uh, one I one R two, very interesting name. There you have it. Um, when you open it up, it screws loose and it reveals the micro USB charging port and also the charging indicator light. Um, it has a, a O ring seal so that it's uh, waterproof. That is very nice because sometimes you drop your keys um, into a puddle when it's uh, raining and this is, yeah, this will still work after you've dropped it. Uh, it also states that it is um, IPX8 waterproof and 1.5 meter um, impact resistant and has a 40 meter throw and it only weighs 13.5 grams. Um, if you turn it uh, then you will uh, get a dim setting first and then after dim you get bright dim bright dim bright and then off let me put it dim dim is still pretty bright and then bright is is very very bright so it's off and then bright dim and off Okay, so that is this little keyring um, key light. I will test that, um, see how long it charges, see how long it lasts on full power. Um, I'm not gonna test low power because um, I'm not gonna uh, just wait for six plus hours or three hours, even if it's half the time, just to wait for this to, um, uh, for this battery to deplete. So we will just test it in, um, in full power. But the review is about this one. So let's, um, yeah, let's review this. Let me tell you about it. Uh, for the review, I will be using this XPG um, CO2 pistol. This is a toy gun. Um, it shoots BBs. So this is, I'll just take the mag out. And this is a toy gun. This is not a real gun. I am only using this for the Picatinny rail at the bottom because this is Picatinny rail mounted. Okay, so if you want to um, mount the light to your, to your gun, you open the Picatinny rail, you can press it a bit wider so that it, um, it goes on easily. 
and then you fit it to the Picatinny rail, you close it, oh, and there you go. Um, it when, oh, when it's in the open position, you can slide it forwards and backwards, uh, depending on the length of your finger. If you have longer fingers, you can slide it forward because what is really cool um, about this light for me um, is the fact that uh, you can just press down there to activate uh, the light and it works both for left and for right so that is pretty cool um, it's very very comfortable um, it i think it can even help with um, some trigger discipline so that you don't put your uh, finger in the uh, on the trigger in the trigger guard this is a very comfortable place just to, to lay your finger. So I think, yeah, this, this might help with, um, with trigger discipline and with a bit of gun safety. And it's easy to get your finger in if you need to. And you can switch it on and off. This is really, really, really small, really light, and it is very very powerful i have to say this this really um <laughs> this is really really for the size it's it's crazy okay so that is the basics of this light um how it's mounted uh the lumens and all of that that's stated we will test everything and i will give you my final verdict when um when we have all the information from my tests, I found that the Valkyrie Mini 2 charges in about 58 minutes and that is less than the stated one hour, which is pretty good. You will have around 11 minutes of full power brightness. After that, it drops off to 35% roughly of the brightness and that will last longer than 60 minutes. This is around 15 meters and as you can see it lights up very very clearly. If I switch the light off then I can almost see nothing with my bare eyes and when I switch the light on it is very very clear. The camera really shows uh, what you see in real life and I have to say this light really really impressed me, especially for the size. There at the back is around 35 meters and it is also a very um, good indication of what your eye will see. Um, you can see very clearly up to 35 meters and it really works quite well. The charging time of the i1R2 is around 79 minutes. You will have 10 minutes of full brightness and an extra 6 minutes until the battery is considered drained. So a total of 16 minutes of usage. After that the brightness really goes down quick. This is the same scenario as the Valkyrie 2. On dim you can see your feet and you can see a, um, around 3-4 meters around you but on 15 meters it's not that bright. This is still dim and that is bright. Now you can see up to 15 meters is very very nice and illuminated and it works perfectly. If you just want to use this as a little walk light, the dim setting is more than enough.
on 35 meters you can barely see the dim um, it doesn't make that much of a difference but if you switch to bright then you really see everything clearly Okay, so I shot the can on about 10 meters and there's one, two, three, four shots and there is the exit shot. Um, the light really works. It really helps to see in the dark. Um, I'll see how the video turned out. Um, I tried to record it, so we'll, we'll see. But um, I would say it really, uh, it really works nicely. It's nice and light on the gun and it's really easy to operate um, to switch on just with your finger okay we are on the farm um, just to quickly uh, test the PL2 mini um, just to see how it does um, yo, there are so many mosquitoes that are just nibbling and chowing and biting um, but I just want to see um, how the light uh, works with the recoil and everything of, uh, of the Glock and we will yeah, we'll just see if it holds up and if it breaks or anything. So we're just going to take a couple of shots and yeah, let's let's see what happens. And the O-Light still perfect, it goes on and off, it's not loose or anything and well that thing sits and it works. Okay so uh, we concluded all our tests last night and I have to say this PL Mini 2 is really really nice, um, it's very bright, it charges up um, quickly, it also um, lasts for a, for a, um, a good while and it's easy to switch on switch off it's easy to mount um yeah it doesn't take much space on the gun and i have to say i am very 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 impressed with how this little um, torch does and as for this i1r2 it is a very very nice little torch it is very very bright i have to say um, the dim setting is very useful when you just want to walk or you just want to find something in the dark and if you want to see a bit further okay so my final thoughts on the valkyrie pl mini 2 it is a very very nice little flashlight it is very bright i was quite surprised when i saw how bright this thing is especially for <laughs> for this little uh, led it uh, it charges quite quickly the battery lasts a long time um, it easily connects to the gun it fits really uh, really solidly it's easy to switch on and off um, it feels very sturdy it is um, it's a it's not heavy but you can feel that it's it's solid and it's strong it's not made of plastic um, so that is that's very very nice uh, the magnetic charger is very cool that you can just um, click on and click off and the fact that um, yeah, it charges uh, under an hour and that was I left it for I think an hour and a half basically to discharge and after that it only took uh, 58 minutes to charge which is under an hour and that is very very nice so if you are um, if you just want to leave it uh, next to your bed on charge or in the car um, with the uh, USB port or even just um, next to your laptop or anything you can just quickly charge it up and then you are ready to go and this little i1r2 uh, this is a very very nice little torch I have to say um, the dim setting is perfect if you're looking for something just um, 
just around you if you're looking for something in the dark uh, like in a bag or in a closet or anything then this on dim setting is perfect and if you want to see a bit further you want to look at something in a tree maybe or um yeah i would say up to 35 maybe 40 meters then you'll still be able to um to make out what it is and see what it is and this is yeah the only con the only thing that that i th um, think of uh, that i could have added is just maybe um a lanyard or neck uh necklace type of thing um just to wear it around your neck or attach it to your arm because it's so small um it would be very easy uh, to lose i used it uh, the past weekend uh, we went camping and i um, I did everything with this small little torch and it worked perfectly. There was just a couple of times where I wasn't sure where I put it or um, when you feel in your pocket and then you don't feel it. Because it's so small, you just feel it miss. So you think, oh no, I've lost my light. But uh, then it's still there. So the only thing is just a lanyard or something just to put around your neck or your arm. Um, especially if you maybe use this for camping. Um, but other than that, uh, it charges also quite quickly and it lasts quite a long time and there's not much more to say. This is a very, very, very nice light um, and everyone that I showed it to was really impressed with how powerful it is and how small it is and the fact that you can just charge it quickly with a micro USB. So thanks for watching. Um, I hope you enjoyed the video. I really enjoyed testing uh, these two flashlights to see uh, if they come close to what um, what's stated on the box and on the paperwork. And in both cases, they basically did a bit better than uh, what was stated. So I'm pretty happy with uh, with this. There's no, um, yeah, they didn't state something that that isn't true. And that yeah, that's always nice when you uh, when you get a bit more out of a product than you thought you would. I have an affiliate link in the description below, so if you want to know where to buy these torches, you can just go um, click on that. And remember uh, the Black Friday sale that starts um, when this video is released, where when you buy one of these um, these PL Mini 2s, you get one of these uh, i1R 2s uh, with, and that is a really, really, really good special um, in my opinion. Okay, so I um, need to go. I'm needed elsewhere. If you have any questions, uh, you can just leave them in the comments. And uh, remember the affiliate link in the description. And as always, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.